Cardinal Suite, Mazalock and GM Michael Gersh discuss the rotation, the emergence of Jack Flaherty and Dakota Hudson, and the resurgence of Adam Wainwright, who had just inked a new one-year deal, puts the rotation on solid ground. Even more so with a potential bounce back year from Miles Michaelis and a return to the rotation by Carlos Martinez, who had been working out of the bullpen after battling through shoulder issues. Well, as we talk about starting pitching, we have some unknowns, we have some question marks. And that's why going into 2020 with adding some additional depth that we know we could stretch out might make sense for us. Um, I mean, Carlos is not somebody we're going to have a good feel for really until late January, early February. And by then, it might be too late to, to find that help. So, you know, I think as we enter into this offseason, you know, giving ourselves some protection there is, is one of the reasons why we keep talking about it. Yeah, flexibility in the, in, in the pitching staff will be huge just because we won't know. I do think our bullpen has the potential to be very strong next year when you think about what Gallegos did and Gant taking a step forward. Hopefully we got Hicks back midsummer, late summer. The one place I feel like we're a bit noisy is sort of the starter versus reliever thing um, because, you know, there's obviously a set of relievers out there that have some interest to us just based on their projections and, you know, sort of the price points. But if we go down that path, you almost close the door on the other. Right. And, you know, I feel like as we look at the, the next, you know, couple days, do we want to really shut doors? And that's sort of my sort of overarching advice is like, maybe we don't, but I, I, I'd, I'd like to sort of the next 48 hours to really see what that looks like. Yeah.